Our brains control the decisions we make. Have you ever pondered all that's involved in the function of the human brain? It has around 100 billion nerve cells, each cell to another 10,000 cells. This means that, in total, we have about 1,000 trillion connections in our brains. These are ultimately responsible for who we are. Our brains control the decisions we make, how we move, and how we feel. The brain's functions keep the intricate organs of the body working in harmony and balance. The human brain is truly remarkable. The four parts of the brain have different functions. For example, the cerebrum is responsible for thoughts, reasoning, planning, emotions, problem solving, and perceptions. The cerebellum works to maintain a balanced muscle tone. Brain stem deals with blood pressure, respiration, and heart rate. Finally, the limbic system controls hunger, thirst, memory, fear, and emotions. These different processes must work together. That's the way it is with the whole human body. Lungs, heart, nerves, and muscles perform incredibly complicated tasks that depend on other duties directed by your brain. No wonder the psalmist concluded that the human body speaks loud and clear of a creator. I will praise you, for I am fearfully and wonderfully made, marvelous are your works, and my soul knows very well, Psalm 139 14. We don't have to go far to find the works of God. The evidence right in our bodies points to an infinitely skillful designer. Consider the chances of a stomach, brain, heart, lungs, arteries, veins, kidneys, ears, eyes, and teeth all developing together and beginning to function at the moment. So what is the most reasonable explanation for the human body's design? Then God said, Let us make man in our image, according to our likeness. So God created man in his image, in the image of God he created him, male and female he created them, Genesis 1 26, 27. The first man and woman could not just have happened. The Bible affirms that God designed us in His image. He is the engineering intelligence who brought us into being. Matthew the creator of this video, an 83-year-old cancer survivor who was educated by God at age 65, would like to show you how his love for others has inspired him to spread health information to others. Please kindly take just a few seconds to subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video. Matthew, the creator 